Hello and welcome to another edition of Ask Cheeky. I'm Isaiah Henkel with Cheeky Scientist. And this week's question comes from Gerlene Alang. What are the main things to look for in an industry job after you get your PhD? Uh, so this could seem like a simple question, but most often PhDs who are transitioning from academia into industry uh, don't know where to start. Uh, we've done several surveys um, and, and different uh, meta-analyses uh, with our associates and, and, and thousands and thousands of, of followers of Cheeky Scientists. And, and one of the, the biggest sticking points that, that many have when it comes to transitioning in industry is simply that, not knowing where to start. Uh, so what, what can you do and what can you do to make sure that you find a company who's a good fit for you? Uh, the first thing is, is do not focus on job titles uh, or salary levels to start. Don't do it. Instead, think of the professional lifestyle you want to have. Uh, if you're watching this, it, it's very likely that you went into academia with one sort of expectation, that you would become a doctor, get a PhD, um, and life would be a certain way, but you didn't really strongly consider the professional lifestyle you'd be living as a postdoc or even as a professor, that you'd be fighting for funding every day or you'd be working you know, at a bench pushing a pipette all day long or with your, your nose in, in a textbook all day long, whatever it might be. Uh, so you have to consider the professional lifestyle you want first and then try to fit a job title and a salary to that. Right? You have to change the way that you're looking at the job market and you got to make under, you got to understand your value so that you can find a company that's a good fit for you, not try to fit yourself to every company in every different position. So that's that's the first thing. Second thing is you need to gain a thorough understanding of the job market and increase your business acumen in general. Start thinking about things with a business mindset, not just an academic mindset. Uh, when you start becoming interested in a company or position, start looking at that company's recent mergers and acquisitions. Uh, what products have they released recently? What mar product markets are they trying to get into? Uh, so you need to increase your business acumen by researching some of these things and having more of a business mindset. Also, you need to understand the job market overall. What positions are hot right now? Right, a lot of companies are hiring uh, for medical science, uh, medical science liaison positions right now. Uh, management consultant positions uh, are are increasing currently. Uh, alternatively, some of these might be on on the downswing when you start looking for a job. Uh, what are some of the the core positions that a lot of PhDs are going into? Right, obviously, research scientist, project management. So there's the R and D arm. Um, but how are companies structured in general, and how are these structures changing? Uh, there's usually an applications arm, right? So you can get hired as an application scientist. You can get into sales and marketing, quality control, uh, maybe intellectual property, maybe patent law. A lot of PhDs are being hired into these regions as well. Uh, so gain a thorough understanding of the job market, but first figure out the professional lifestyle you want. Figure out this lifestyle. Start fitting positions to this lifestyle to make sure that you are fulfilled uh, when you make the transition. Uh, and, and then increase your business acumen. So when you start going through the job search a process, you start having interviews, you can talk intelligently with a business mindset, not just an academic mindset. So until next time, remember your value as a PhD and start thinking acting like a successful industry professional.